morning guys, welcome to today. Today is Tuesday and it's scorching. Hi Posey! All right, I figured it out. These guys are not in love with the heat, the sun. That's why they've come in to stand in the shade. I think that's why they put their head in the wall is because they think it's like the shade. Have some water. I know, because you, see, this is what she likes to do. Spill her bucket. See, mama knew you needed a drink. Her bucket was half full, spill over. There you go. Good? <laughs> it's too hot to spill your bucket. I don't know why she does that. I don't know why you do that. You're so sweet. I love you. Don't lay in the mud. Oh my gosh. That's why I have a nice blanket here for you to lay down. Come here, baby. Come here. Oh no, look what you did to your belly. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's what happens when you lay in water. Come here. Come here, if you want me to pet you, you have to come closer. I can't reach that far. I'll move closer. There we go. Anyways, you guys know it's almost Sophie's birthday. I'm excited. She doesn't know that she already owns Lady, so I don't know if it's really like a good birthday present. Well, I guess it is. Anyway, she's gonna be 15 years old. She, she, her birthday's in a month. She's gonna be 15 years old and she's gonna get her second horse. Actually, I guess that's not true. Her second ever riding horse. Actually, that's not true. Her third ever riding horse. At this point, she's already had Lady for a couple of months and they've already been riding and showing and doing all the things. So it's not gonna be like a big, huge surprise. Like, guess what, we bought Lady. She already knows that I'm buying Lady. She like, because I can't say to her, oh, I might not buy her, like, to make it a surprise. I can't, I can't say like that. I can't say that because I never want her to ever fear that her horse is gonna go somewhere. So she knows she's getting her, she just doesn't know when. But I need ideas, you guys. Somebody sent me, somebody randomly sent me a uh, message the other day and said, oh my gosh, you should do this to surprise her. And it was such a good idea, but it's not gonna work for us. So I need ideas, like, I wanna make it special. I wanna like, be able to say like, hey, for your birthday, one of your presents is that you get to keep Lady, that we bought her and she's yours now and all that kind of stuff. I wanna do it in a way that makes it super fun for her. Maybe I can make her a certificate or um, something that just says that she's her owner or something like that. I don't know. I just want to make it special. And Sophie really wants to take Lady to the beach. So maybe when it gets closer to her birthday, we'll do something like that. So if you have an idea, comment below and tell me what you think would be fun. No, don't worry. I'm not leaving you yet. Don't worry. I just love you. Yeah, she's so sweet. So uh, last night, Sam closed the chickens in. So they go in after it gets dark. They go into the hut and then Sam goes out and he, or, and then Sam went out and put them away. He didn't tell Sophie to go with him, but usually Sophie goes with him. Hi babies. So he did it all himself and he came back in and told Sophie, don't worry, I already did the chickens. Everything was fine until this morning. So we came out this morning to do chores. What's the problem, eh? Do you need more water in your pool? Yes, you do, because it's gonna be hot for the rest of this whole week. Look at this little guy, it's almost as big as the pig now. Almost as tall as the pig. And maybe you grow more. The more you pee on your face, the more you grow, maybe. Maybe that's how he thinks it works. Anyways, I came out this morning and I heard somebody call from me, call to me from like the chicken area. So I went over to look. It just sounded so soulful, like so sad. And I looked and my little Tom turkey was left outside last night. So every time we do chores and we put the chickens and the turkeys to bed, we count them, we do a head count. We can't count everybody because you can't, you can't just tell everybody's in there by looking. You have to count, you know, how many chickens we have, how many turkeys, how many guineas, how many ducks? And Sam said that the turkeys always just go in so he doesn't count them. He just doesn't count them. And my boy turkey got left out all night. All night he got left out. <laughs> You're hurting me. <laughs> and that wasn't the saddest part. So I was so upset. So, so was Sophie. We were like, we were literally so upset. We were like almost in tears because he was out there and he was all alone. Like, I almost know when they're separated that they are more at risk. So anyways, I just imagine he had like a scary night and I felt so bad for him and I felt awful. So we let everybody out. But was the saddest 
was that one of the little girls was so upset she ran to him and she missed him last night like I don't know if she thought he was just gone or whatever but then they were like cuddling each other like they were so happy to see each other and just broke my heart like that's like something that's so sensitive to me is that if one of my animals ever got separated from what they know and what they love and I don't know it just left out in the cold like nobody cared about them like it just hurt my heart so bad you guys <laughs> right Winston right look at him he just climbs up on my lap I love you everybody loves you because you are a nice boy and that's why we kept you even though you're a boy because you're just the sweetest boy guys look at what's happening Stop chewing the cord. Look what's happening. That's the closest he ever got to me. I want to touch him. Oh, he touched me. Look, you guys. You see him? He's up on this little bench with me. I love him. I just want to pet you. I swear, I just said, I just want to pet you. And he said, bah, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> no. Mwah, this guy is so sweet. I told you guys I'm going to bring the girl goats over here and let them be bred in the boy pen, in the buck pen. And I think everything will go okay, except for I'm a little bit worried about him trying to mount them. I know that they won't let him mount them. And I know that never in the history of the world has a pig ever bred a goat. So that's okay. But what I'm worried about is that he's heavy. And if he tries to mount one of them, I don't want them to get, like, damaged or I don't want anything bad to happen. So I think he might have to be banished. If I have to banish him, because he's so sweet, I might make that round ring over there. I might make that his new home. I might, because there's a shelter in there. I can put his pool in there. I can put his food and his water in there for him. And then every day he could stay out there while the goats do their stuff. I'm not going to lie. He just walked up to me and let me pet him. Isn't that crazy? It's because he knows that to get to the girls, he needs me. That's the first time he's ever let me do anything to him, you guys ever and he kind of chose are you gonna eat my fingers i love you i really like my buck i'm so happy with him other than the fact that he's a screamer why are you so friendly hey <laughs> i love you well tom turkey's doing okay wait tom he's like what do you have in your hands there hey don't jump on me uh oh i better run he doesn't come to me all uh oh shoot grab me grab that apple quick hello pose everybody's just standing here all right how do you guys know just wait turn on the light ow shoot grab that apple i'm okay. having problems okay what i'm thinking i'm gonna try and do is i'm just gonna go like that go a pow if she lets me do it with my finger i she should right but she'll put it she'll let it drip out of her mouth all right, it's deworming day on the farm. Everybody's excited. I know honey will be good. Even so Posey, gonna she's going to get dewormed too. Oh, really? Yep. And I brought apples. Everybody gets an apple after. Gabby's a professional. She's Gabby's a professional. I am a professional. Get the halter. All right, so let's see who's... How come this lady who doesn't have a fly mask on? Because I don't know where her fly mask is. Somebody took it off and never gave it back. How much does she get? Hi, baby. Hi, oh, Gracie. <laughs> She's screaming because she knows I have apples. She's Sorry, like, I Seth. need some too. Hold on, you guys are all going to get an apple. He does not like this. I know, you got to hold his head up. Sophie, you got to hold her head up too. We don't know with her. We've never tried. Uh oh. <laughs> He'll hold that in his mouth. <laughs> and then he's not even breathing while he's breathing with his nose. Don't let him. No, I'm pretty sure he's going to drop it all over her back. He just spit it out. Really? Here, give him an apple. He's got it. Yeah. That thing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so this would be good. For you ready? Me. Yeah. This is an apple. Put her head up. Put her head up. Oh, it's cute. going out. It's going out. She ate it. Okay, get an apple. You're good, lady. 
Apple. Good <laughs> job. <laughs> They're all not going to be coming up to us Garbage. soon. All right, it's Honey's turn. You trust me. Get up there. Get up there. Oh no. Well, I just lost half the apple. Yeah. yeah, Posey knows there's apples, that's for sure. <laughs> Cakes can be pretty demanding. All right, so Lady won't take an apple now. <laughs> Ew. Here. Um, Beat it off. They're like the minis. This is good for, um, for Willow. All right, Willow, what your turn next. Lady understands that she had an apple now. Storm is still eating his apple. <laughs> He's not happy about it. Watch it, she's an angel this time. Oh, that's not even. Two. Gracie's watching and she's like, I'm not. Gracie's making a run for it. You only had one. Look at how gorgeous her hair looks. Okay, apple for her. It's an apple. That's what's funny though, is that when she gives it to them, they won't even trust you. It's just an apple. Just a bite because she's a fatty. She gets half of it. All right, half of it. Sophie's surrounded by her horses. You already had one, no ma'am. No ma'am. Gracie's okay. walking away. I know. Gracie says no. The lady really wants me. Okay. Honey. Honey. You won't. There. Do you like it? She's yeah. like, no. Yet. Ladies, like, such a giraffe. Yeah, she all the apples. <laughs> that, that's it's the terrible. funny part. They don't believe. They're like, mm, no thanks. I don't like treats for me. Come on. <laughs> oh. You were just begging me. Come on, Chunky. All right, girlfriend, your turn. Did you do Gracie already? Yes. Oh, you did Gracie? Yes. Did she get an apple? No. Oh. She's like, there's a, one more reason to not like you, Gabby. I dewormed Posey. Wait, you just did it? Yeah, I just shoved it in her mouth. Pixie. And she's like, mm, thank you very much. <laughs> now I'll eat that apple. But she's only getting half the apple because I have to go do the boy. And I'm going to need help with him, probably. He's like, you want me, don't you? <laughs> like your apple? We've got an apple for a goat. Here, you want to give the apple to the goat, so? Girls? Well, I don't know. <laughs> Whoever's here. I got it. The boys won't. I did it. The pigs are so dumb. He wasn't that dumb. He ran away from you. Oh, he's out. spitting it out. <laughs> this is my boy. I know. I love him. He loves me, too. You're stealing. You're trying to steal all my animals this week. Because they, I spend time with them. And they all love me. Well, I've been busy. He, oh, I love him now. He came up to me today. But he comes up here, and he peeps on the girls. He stares through here. Don't you know that